from bizarre rumors about Tom Cruise's death back in 2010 to reports of Supreme Leader Kim Jong-un's assassination, here are some of the best celebrity death hoaxes you definitely fell for. Let's start with SpongeBob SquarePants. Okay, I don't actually mean SpongeBob himself. I mean, as much as I want to believe that there's a sponge living in a pineapple under the sea, I'm actually talking about the voice actor of this beloved cartoon character. Yep, Tom Kenny's had plenty of death hoaxes in one lifetime, and being a comedian, Kenny can't help but just laugh at them at this point. Whenever reports of his alleged passing away take the rounds on the internet, somehow people always end up believing them. And I bet you did too. Come on, it's the digital age. You don't have to be all that gullible anymore. So yeah, Tom Kenny's alive and kicking. And next time someone asks you to retweet to thank Kenny for making your sad, sad childhood a tad bit happier, maybe try doing your own research? Speaking of research, these fans sure forgot to do some when they started a chain of rumors about The Rock's death. This happened when Dwayne Johnson was busy filming for the seventh installment of the Fast and Furious movies. Like, okay, yes, those movies require actors to do plenty of stunts, but come on, to think The Rock would succumb to death during a stunt? Really? He's called The Rock for a reason. Anyway, some fans ended up spreading some rumors about how Dwayne Johnson had passed away while filming a stunt for the movie. And you know The Rock, he's not one to let these moments of controversy slip away that easily. He went to his Facebook and let his fans know that he was pretty much alive. Unless, of course, they believe he was back from the dead. On Twitter, he even went on to ask the person who started that wildfire of rumors to step forward, so he could show them how a dead foot feels up their ass. Well, that's Dwayne The Rock Johnson for you. People better think twice the next time they start some sort of hoax about his death. But forget actors. This is something that can happen to world leaders. Everyone believed Kim Jong-un had been assassinated once. Remember that little fun moment in history? I bet you had a pretty good laugh back in 2012 when the news started going wild with the report of Korean dictator Kim Jong-un getting assassinated. South Korea is sending a stark message to the North. It's preparing to assassinate North Korean leader Kim Jong-un if Seoul feels threatened by a nuclear attack. Before you could even say Kim who, everyone was in an uproar. That's nobody's fault though. It's just that these days, can you really pick any political leader out of the lineup? Anyway, it all started because of Weibo, a Chinese microblogging social media platform, which isn't all that different from Twitter. But as it turned out, it wasn't true news at all. And Kim's still alive and well, much to the disappointment of his political enemies. It's funny how rumors can get out of hand, uh, but I guess that's what the internet does best. Now, if only we could come up with a new fun story. Uh, wait a second, I do have one. It's about Sean Connery. Back in 1993, the entire world thought that the legendary Sean Connery had left us for the great beyond, and it all started with some confusion. The story went that James Hunt, a former champion Formula One racer, had expired. Well, someone misread that as James Bond, and lo and behold, everyone from Spain to Japan was convinced that Sean Connery was pushing up daisies. And you know what? It got worse. People started hearing that Governor John Connolly had passed away. For those who were in Japan, Connolly and Connery sounded indistinguishable. Do you see where I'm going with this? Yeah, by then reports of Sean's passing were everywhere. But then he showed up on The Letterman Show to put all those rumors to rest. But none of it beats the time. One of Hollywood's greats was presumed dead. I'm talking about Tom Cruise. Well, you all know what the internet is capable of, don't you? Remember Remember when they said Mission Impossible star Tom Cruise died in a plumbing accident in 2010? Yeah, I can't believe we all fell for that. It was too hard to believe that the beloved actor had passed away so suddenly. So it was no wonder when there was a collective gasp of relief when he appeared on camera laughing, saying, hey, I'm really alive. He even joked that he must have been a hologram. Classic Tom, huh? He went on to ask his audience if the internet got it wrong again. We don't know, Tom, but as long as you're all right, that's all that matters, right? But if you're shocked that you fell for that, wait until you hear about this next one. I'm talking about the greatest urban legend in the world of rock music. Are you ready? Because this one's a good one, I promise you. Have you ever heard the rumor that Paul McCartney, a member of the legendary Beatles, had died? Looks like those death hoaxes didn't leave poor Paul McCartney alone either. And the craziest part is, this rumor began all the way back in 19. 
1866. To this day, no one really knows how it even started in the first place. So it's not just a death hoax, it's a mysterious one too. It all started with reports of a car crash. On top of that, there were McCartney's disappearing public appearances. So when the Iowa State University newspaper asked, is Beatle Paul McCartney dead? People ended up actually thinking maybe this beloved Beatle really was no more. With this sequence of events, you could say stories about his death had some legs. From then on, there were countless claims of coded messages in the White Album and Abbey Road, and all of them added to the suspicion of McCartney's passing away. Some people even said you could hear, Paul is a dead man, miss him, miss him, when rewinding the final few garbled seconds of I'm so tired. But then, Paul McCartney himself announced a global headlining tour in 2013, and you get the gist, the Beatle was alive and kicking. Speaking of musicians, it's time I talked about the hoaxes that another singer's been subjected to. Yep, I'm referring to the one and only queen of music, Rihanna. Well, did any of you hear about the crazy news in January 2011? Sure, it's pretty old, but it's one of the best ones on this list so far. People were reporting that the beloved pop princess Rihanna had passed away Way in a fiery plane crash. And it wasn't the only rumor about her death that made the rounds on the internet that year. Yep, poor Riri has had two fake news stories circulate about her death. The second one was on some phony French website, where they were saying that Rihanna had slipped into a coma due to an alcohol overdose. But that wasn't all. They even proclaimed that she had a heart attack during the coma and died. Well, ouch. Fortunately, none of these rumors were true. Rihanna's alive and well, and I know there are a lot of headlines about her, so it can be extremely hard to keep up with everything. But don't always trust these tabloid sources. Anyway, it's time for the last one, people, and it's none other than Justin Bieber. Bieber's been a star for quite some time, and the price of such superstardom? Well, countless death hoaxes. Back in 2009, everyone was convinced that the singer had committed suicide. And then just one year later, in 2010, guess what rumors sprang up. Yep, the one about him being shot dead in a nightclub. What's more, some people reported back in 2012 that Bieber had kicked the bucket from an unexplained R.I.P. Justin Bieber tweet. I mean, it's almost like making up celebrity death hoaxes online has become a thing. You got any interesting ones to share?